guys, Michelle here with Home Co Lumber and Hardware and February's Young Builders Project. This month we're going to be making a heart string art. So what you'll get is one piece of wood, a heart template, nails, string, and a hammer. And what you'll do, your first step is to put your heart right on this wood piece. To hold your heart in place, you're gonna take your nails and you're going to hammer them all along the traced outline of the heart. I like to start right here in the middle to hold it in place. So we'll just hammer our nails in. Okay, so when we hammer these nails in, we're not hammering them all the way. We're leaving them up a bit because that's how we wrap the string around to make our design. So we're gonna go around the entire heart. You ready? Did you guys know Valentine's Day, February 14th, is when the state of Arizona was started or founded? Okay, so I have a couple nails left, but my heart is complete like I want it to be, so I'm not going to use these. If you have a couple nails left, you can add them or just give them to someone else to use. Once we're done and we have this all together, we're going to gently pull off our template. Kind of like unwrapping a present. It's okay if you rip it. You can be a little smooth about it though so that you don't pull out any of your nails because they're not all the way sunk into your wood piece. Okay guys, so once we've peeled off our paper, if you want to paint your project, you can paint it from here. Um, I painted mine white and it even got the nails white to make the pink string stand out. Um, but whatever you'd like, if you wanna leave it plain, you can go from there. If you decide to paint it, you do need to make sure that it's dry all the way before you start putting your strings on. So let's start with putting those strings on. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take the end piece of our string and we're gonna tie a knot right on the center nail. If you need help tying a knot, and if you're here at HomeCo, let one of us know. We're happy to help you. Your mom or dad can help you, or whoever brings you can help you. But we wanna make sure that that knot is nice and tight so that your string doesn't fall off. And then from there, we wanna pull our string tight and going from nail to nail, we're just gonna wrap it around. There's no rules on which nail you put it around. If you go sideways, and if you can see how that happens, you might need an extra hand, but you can go up here. The idea is to keep it very tight so that it doesn't come off. And you also wanna make sure you get every outside nail so that you keep the shape of the heart. And if you can see some of the areas that don't seem to have a lot of string, I'm just going back and forth with them and then wrapping around the outside edge to make sure that I create, keep creating the line of the heart. Okay, now once I'm done, I'm gonna tie my knot here and cut off the edge of my string. So we just are tying our final knot here you don't want to lose any of that snugness, so make sure that you ask someone to help you to tie it nice and tight so that your heartstrings stay on. Okay, there we go. There's our heart. I love it. Okay, guys, we hope to see you here at HomeCo on the third Saturday of February to make your heartstring project. And again, if you're unable to make it in, any extras that we have, we're happy to hand out to you when you come into the store. We'll see you soon. Thank you for watching. Please keep an eye out for next month's project.